Good morning, guys. I'm currently six miles into an 11 mile easy run. It's a beautiful Tuesday, and if you can't tell, we're not in Texas. We're in Nashville, Tennessee. I am now officially splitting time between Austin and Nashville. A small part of the BPN media team moved down to Nashville and we are building a satellite BPN office downtown Nashville. So our team will now occupy two cities. Lots of life updates in this video. of today we are 75 days out from my next marathon which is CIM and training here is a little different definitely not those Texas flats lots of rolling Tennessee hills and you know some new scenery to run around and through has been very just engaging it hits it's a little different right now weekly mileage is just above 70 and that will climb the longer we get into this build with coach jeff now this past month has been pretty crazy so we moved here got settled for a week and we flew out to maine for the last man standing ultra marathon and as soon as we got back from that, we got the keys to the new BPN office. So we're right downtown. Office space wise, we have 3,500 square feet on a second floor. And then we're getting access to the first floor, which is currently a gym. And we will use as a gym this December. So we'll have roughly 7,000 square feet total. Last night we crossed a pretty big milestone for myself and for this YouTube channel. The channel hit 1 million subscribers, which is a big milestone. And I pretty much started the channel when I got to Texas with the military in 2014. And since then, we've uploaded over 900 videos and I've documented every part of my life now with a move to Tennessee and this next chapter of brand building and expansion of BPN crossing that 1 million subscriber mark last night was pretty amazing so first off I want to thank you thank you for supporting me and the brand and the content and last night as Steph and I were waiting for that real-time YouTube subscriber count to cross over the 1 million mark we were watching old YouTube videos which was so nostalgic and honestly emotional and I watched this one video and it was a video when I returned from South Korea and my brother and parents were waiting for me and I landed back in the States and we instantly drove to the first BPN office and HQ and warehouse that my brother and I signed a lease for when I was overseas. And that period of time facilitated so much growth for us and I see direct parallels between that chapter of my life and this chapter of my life growth is a choice and sometimes growth requires change that's what I can feel right now that's what I know we're about to experience 
that's why I'm so jacked up about this journey and chapter. Eleven miles complete, one hour, twenty five minutes, and six seconds at a seven forty four minute per mile pace. I've been wearing this hat recently on my runs. A lot of people have been asking about it. This is the BPN Go One More CLE collab launching very soon. Love this hat. So you got Go One More on the front here, CLE Athletics on the side. Nice little buckle strap back here. It's probably my favorite part. A-Rod designed this. It's like a Texas Go One More BPN custom camo. Love that, he crushed that. We'll probably start using that on, on more apparel items. Breakfast for baby Charlie is served. We got French toast, we got banana, and we have cheese. <laughs> Dive on in. Yep, going for the French toast first. A, B, C, D, E, foo. You going for the cheese? And now banana. I like your, uh, I like your approach. Charlie is officially 14 months old. She's doing great, she's eating well, she's enjoying her new city and new home, and all the walks and parks and trails we've been spending time on. You know, I used to make her Charlie cakes in the morning. <laughs> she didn't really like Charlie cakes anymore, so now we're, we're on a big fruit kick. French toast is a, is a fan favorite, but cheese is one of her favorite things in the world. Now, as I mentioned earlier, there is currently an active gym below us. So if you hear the music playing right now, it's because they're still operating out of that space until they move into their expansion here in a few weeks or short months. We're supposed to take over that lease December 1st. So down there, down those stairs, is the gym that we will occupy. And then the office spaces is right here. And I can see downtown Nashville right from the office. It's a great location. So let's do the official tour. You walk in, it is super echoey in here because we have very limited rugs or furniture yet. But this is the lobby or lounge. This entire wall, the first week in October is getting a mural done. We're gonna put a bunch of memorabilia on that wall there, that shiplap wall and then we'll have couches and chairs, coffee table, BPN products on floating shelves on this wall to showcase. But I love the exposed ventilation, love the ceilings, love the shiplap. Now this is gonna be my office right here, and then you have this long hallway that has offices broken off from it. So this will be Jordan's office, Ian's office there. This right here is gonna be our podcast studio. So we're getting a wood accent wall installed next week, painting it black and then acoustic panels throughout. Some additional office space. And then this is our conference room, AKA war room. Don't really have a full vision for this yet, but it has a lot of potential. And across from the bathrooms, we have a little kitchenette. I do need to add and replace some of the lighting because Certain parts of this office are a little dark. We just want to brighten it up. So I'll probably like pull that light down, replace that light and just brighten this space up a little bit. We got our fridge being delivered end of this week. 
and then I'll put uh, a table and some shelving and floating shelves on this wall as well. So that's the office space. Really excited to occupy the gym below and we are going to be hosting events here once the gym is opened up early 2024. This is my assistant, this is Stephanie. She's new. Just trying to do my best. She's been crushing it. Uh, I'm about to go link up with Jordan and Ian. They are preparing to record or we are recording the, the post-race recap interview for the Last Man Standing video they are working on. And Steph and I recently have been crushing dried mango. This is the best one we found. Parasol Superfoods, that's some good dried mango. Shout out Cat and Bobby, who brought this to Last Man Standing and we all crushed, poor Bob, I think it was for Bobby and we ate it all before he even got here. Yeah, when I was coming in at the- it's like candy. The checkpoints for rest periods, I was craving dried mango. So good. I mean, this is literally like a fruit roll up, you know? It's good. Tuesdays are our favorite, including Charlie's, because guess what Tuesdays are? It's Farmer Market Tuesday, and we can walk. That's how close we are. Amazing. So we're gonna get some sourdough, we're gonna get some meat, we're gonna get some eggs, we're gonna explore. They have the world's best pickled beets here that I missed out on last week and I'm hoping are here this week. And Charlie's just gonna snack on a little bit of everything. <laughs> yep, let's go. What you getting? I've never been to a farmer's market. This is your first time? Yeah. Oh, watching, dude. I'm watching the interaction. How are we looking? A little raw milk. Get the gut right. Get the bowel movement right. I'll tell you what, I'm making amazing friends here at the Nashville Farmer's Market. Met this guy here. Yeah, playing the band over there. Come check us out. See if your community farm. We got a, a meat guy now. We got a beet guy. We got a pasta sauce person. Raw milk supplier. Can't beat it. And about to pick up our weekly sourdough. Charlie, it's your best friends. We'll get there. We'll get there. Okay, weekly farmers market pickups. We have the best beets in the entire world. There is cinnamon allspice and onions in these beets. Bratton and Jones Farms LLC, delicious. We got some lettuce, some boneless chicken thighs, some brats. We got some fresh farm eggs. We got two dozen eggs. This is some of the best sourdough we've ever had. The last two weeks, Steph and I have crushed a loaf in a matter of a day and a half. We literally just like lay it out and, and rip it apart. Uh, these are some sourdough cookies. We got some potatoes, some honey. The honey is from the same uh, place as the sourdough. Some raw, unpasteurized milk, and then some bagels. We uh, we are completely stocked up on a lot of meat, veggies, and fruit. So this is just a few pickups this week. So I'm currently getting all moved in and set up in my new home office that I'm currently sitting in. But tomorrow's speed workout that Jeff has programmed for me is a two mile warm up, and then nine times 1000 meter repeats in three minutes, 35 seconds to three minutes, 38 seconds. So I have three seconds to play with. And then one minute walks in between each one of those repeats. And then there's a cool down. 
These are the world's best beets. Beets, onions, cider vinegar, water, cinnamon, mustard seed, allspice, and salt. The mustard seed and allspice and cinnamon make such a big difference. It smells so good. These things with some rice and ground beef and buffalo sauce and coconut aminos. Man, those are some of the best things I've ever had in my life. Those are some good beats. Mmm, man, wow, wow, wow. That's good. So we're gonna wrap up the video right here, but I wanted to make this video as a life update to keep you guys informed about what we're doing, setting up this new office in Nashville, going back and forth between Texas and, and Tennessee. I'm super excited about the opportunities that we are creating to build the brand, amplify the message, the mission, and, and what we're doing. And I'm just really excited for this next chapter. I'm so excited and I, I, I see so much potential and growth opportunity and I'm ready to just go after it and seize it. Again, thank you for helping us reach 1 million subscribers on YouTube. Here's to this next chapter. Here's, here's to the future and here's to uh, what we're gonna do next. So thanks guys. I appreciate you. I love you. Going more.